Do you ever wonder why companies release so many versions of a GPU or CPU? Like why is there a 3080, a 3080 Ti, a 3090, a Ryzen 9, a Ryzen 7, when they all use the exact same chip? When manufacturers produce chips, they're made in massive batches from silicon wafers. But due to tiny imperfections during the process, not every chip comes out perfect. Some have bad sectors, which are small areas that don't function properly. They're not enough to ruin the whole chip, but they can't perform at top level either. So they test every chip, the best performing ones, no defects, great efficiency, get binned into top tier products like the RTX 3090. Chips with a few flaws, those become the 3080 Ti or the 3080. Same idea with CPUs. If a Ryzen 9 has two defective cores, AMD disables them and sells it as a Ryzen 7. This lets companies reuse more chips instead of tossing them away. You still get a great product, just with some parts turned off. It's also why some chips overclock better than others. Even two identical CPUs might perform differently. That's what people mean when they say the silicon lottery. So next time you're shopping for parts, remember that your 3070 might be running on a slightly bruised 3080. Be sure to follow for more tech tips.